I've created a game for Android that is about a human with superhuman powers and he can actually fly around the map but he is trapped in a reality with powerful monsters. Flying system contains a complicated animation system that can talk with other parts of the game to give the player the best experience possible. This is the first monster I have created and it can knock you out with one hit but since the whole thing is an illusion the character can't die and has to somehow escape. This is where you wish you could die. All of the monsters are being controlled with a monster manager to make sure there is no lag when the character kills a monster or changes something in the environment. But. As you can see, we have a long way to fix all the bugs in the game, so let's start fixing together. This is the first monster I created and it has physics capsules to simulate ragdoll on the mesh, but it's not as precise as the main character because performance is everything in this game. This is how precise the main character's ragdoll is. The monster's AI is pretty complicated and it takes a lot of coding to make it work. The game features a dynamic weather and fog system with rain and dynamic clouds. Everything is created procedurally to make sure we can have a lot of content in the future and no one has the same experience as others. I have been trying to emphasize heavily on using VFX and particle systems to achieve a more engaging experience and get a more attractive look and a complicated animation system that will only get better in time. What do you think we need to add to this game? Let me know in the comment section.